So many of you have heard the term affirmations, where you make, say something over and over again. Affirmations by themselves sometimes just lead to dilution. If you go, I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm happy. Your brain goes, bullshit, you're not happy. Because you're saying it verbally, but you're not embodying it with your whole body. What I want you to do is to try something. I want you to feel strong, feel your body, and shout the word yes with all your intensity. Go. Yes. Say it again. Yes. Even stronger. Yes. One more time. Yes. Now, in this state of certainty, I want you to think about that goal you wrote down earlier, those two goals. That goal, that desire. And how are you going to feel when you actually achieve it, when you make it happen? And all I want you to do in your body is, I want you to lock in that sense of certainty. We're going to do it two ways. First, we're just going to say a phrase, these couple of phrases over and over. And then to finish here, we're going to shake the building with our intensity. And what we're going to do is anchor into our body that feeling of yes, 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 as you think about your goal. And then we're going to wrap up and you'll go to lunch. Shake your body out. Repeat this phrase after me. Now I am the voice. Now I am the voice. I will lead, not follow. I will believe, not doubt. I will create, not destroy. I am a force for good. I am a leader. Defy the odds. Set a new standard. Step up. Step up. Step up. Use your whole body. Now I am the voice. Now I am the voice. I will lead, not follow. I will believe, not doubt. I will create, not destroy. I am a force for good. I am a leader. Defy the odds. Set a new standard. Step up. Step up. Step up. Think about what it means when you say, now I am the voice. Your real voice is never the voice of fear. Your real voice is never the voice of worry. Your real voice has strength and certainty within it. It knows the truth of who you are and what you're made for. Breathe like you breathe when you feel strong. And when you say, now I am the voice, that means you're no longer the voice of fear. It's no longer the voice of your past. It's who you are made to be. When you say, I will lead, not follow, that doesn't mean other people have to follow you. It just means you live life on your standards and that you'll never settle for less than you were made to be or do or create in your life, that you will not settle. How does it feel when you step up and you claim who you are? Make a sound of how that feels in your body, ladies and gentlemen. How does it feel to create, not destroy, to create love, to create joy, to know in your life you're a giver, not a taker. To know your life matters. How does it feel when you know you're here to lead? What does it feel like when you look at your fear or you look at your laziness or you look at your past and instead of dealing with it, you defy it? How does it feel when you stand in defiance of anything that would stop you? How strong do you feel when you say, give me your best shot and you push through it? How does it feel? What kind of pride do you have inside? When you just step up and claim your true identity, when you raise that standard, think about what that means, and we'll do this six times with all your intensity in your body. Here we go, nice and loud. Now I am the voice. Now I am the voice. I will lead, not follow. I will believe, not doubt. I will create, not destroy. I am a force for good. I am a leader. Defy the odds. Set a new standard. Step up. Step up. Step up. Use your whole body. Now I am the voice. Now I am the voice. I will lead, not follow. I will believe, not doubt. I will create, not destroy. I am a force for good. I 
am a leader. Defy the odds. Set a new standard. Step up. Step up. Step up. One more time. Now I am the voice. Now I am the voice. I will lead, not follow. I will believe, not doubt. I will create, not destroy. I am a force for good. I am a leader. Defy the odds. Set a new standard. Step up. Step up. Step up. Step up. Step up. Whoa! Come on! I want you to feel your center right now, your strength. I want you just inside yourself, promise yourself, you're never going to settle. Never settle for less than you can be, do, give, or create. Think about what you were made for. Every month, Every molecule, every atom in your body is replaced. Every year, every cell in your body is replaced. The skin on your hands gets replaced every 30 days. The inside of your stomach, every six weeks. The body that's in front of me right now that you're residing in is the 2007 model. The 2006, no longer here. It's been ashes and dust for a long time. So if every 30 days, Everything inside you, everything that physically makes you up is something new. That means today you're a different person than you were a month ago. The reason your life looks the same way is because you keep thinking with the same standards, the same organizing beliefs. But you change that, everything changes. All you got to do, my friends, is hold a new standard that you're going to constantly strengthen your state, your focus, your physiology.